Hello everyone, welcome to our channel. I am Afreen Khan and in this video, I would like to discuss difference and similarities between microeconomics and macroeconomics. So without further ado, let's get started. Every single day Let's discuss what is economics. Economics is the science which studies human behavior as relationship between given ends and scare means which have alternative views. Economics is a study about how individuals, businesses and governments make choices on allocating resources to satisfy their needs. These groups determine how the resources are organized and coordinated to achieve maximum output. They are mostly concerned with the production, distribution, and consumption of goods and services. Economics is divided into two important sections, which are macroeconomics and microeconomics. So, let's start the differentiation first between these two terms. I will differentiate the topics with the help of basis. So, our first base for comparison is meaning. Microeconomics is the branch of economics that is related to the study of individual household and firm's behavior in decision making and allocation of the resources. It comprises market of goods and services and deals with the economic issues. On the other hand, macroeconomics is the branch of economics that deals with the study of behavior and performance of total economy. The most important factors studied in economics involve gross domestic product that is also known as GDP. Or and employment, inflation, and growth rate, etc. Another base for comparison is area of study. Microeconomics studies the particular market uh, segment of economy. On the other hand, macroeconomics studies the uh, whole economy that covers the several market segments. Third base is deals with. Microeconomics deals with various issues related to demand, supply, factor pricing, product pricing, economic welfare, production, consumption, and many more. On the other hand, macroeconomics deals with various, issue, various issues like national income, distribution, employment, journal price level, money, and many more. Fourth base for comparison is business application. In microeconomics, business application is applied to internal issues. And on the other hand, in macroeconomics, business application is applied to environmental and external issues. Fifth base for comparison is significance. In microeconomics, it is useful in uh, regulating the prices of a product alongside the prices of, uh, prices of factor of production. Uh, that are labor, land, entrepreneur, capital, and many more within the economy. And uh, in macroeconomics, it maintains firmness in the broad price level and solves the major issues of the economy like uh, uh, inflation, deflation, rising prices, unemployment, and poverty as a whole. Last base is limitation. In microeconomics, it is based on is based on impractical presupposition. That is, in microeconomics, it is presumed that there is a full employment in the economy and uh, which is not at all feasible. And on the other hand, in macroeconomics, that the misconception of composition incorporates which sometimes fails to prove accurate because it is feasible that which, uh, that what is true for aggregate may not be true for individuals as well. Now with this, we have completed the difference between, between, between these two terms. Now let's jump to similarities that what will be the similarities of uh, uh, similarities between microeconomics and macroeconomics. So now we are going to discuss some similarities between microeconomics and macroeconomics. 
Although it is very much convenient to split up the economics into two branches that are microeconomics and macroeconomics as we have discussed these two terms in our previous topic and uh, it is some extend an uh, artificial divide like micro uh, principles are used in macroeconomics if you study the impact of devaluation you are likely to use same economic principles such as elasticity of demand uh, to changes in price second similarity between these two terms are microeconomics effects macroeconomics and vice versa for example if we see uh, a rise in oil prices then this will have a significant impact on cost push inflation another example if technology reduces cost this enables faster economic rate next similarity between these two terms is blurring of distinction if house prices rise then this is a micro eco uh, economic effect for the housing market but housing market is so influential that it could also be considered as a macroeconomic variable and will influence monetary policy last but not the least similarity uh, is there have been efforts to use computer models of household behavior to predict the impact the impact on the macroeconomy with this i hope the topic is clear if you have any query you can comment down below i'll surely reply or clear your doubt so if you want to have more comparison between uh, videos so please check out my comparison between playlist uh, on my channel and uh, most important please subscribe to my channel and press the notification bell so that you will be notified whenever we upload new videos till then bye bye thanks for watching